Hello children, welcome to our class 6th science chapter 7 separation of substances activity 2 today we are going to learn the topic is sedimentation and decantation take a mixture of soil and water in a glass tumbler and keep it undisturbed for some time what do you observe you will find that the sand and mud particles in the soil settle at the bottom of the glass tumbler these are called sediments this process of separation of mud and sand is called sedimentation what is the definition of sedimentation sedimentation is the process in which insoluble heavy particles in a liquid are allowed to settle down at the bottom of a container after sedimentation the tumbler is gently lifted the tip of the tumbler is inclined on the edge of another tumbler without disturbing the sediments like this the water gets separated from the sediment this process is called decantation what is the definition of decantation the process of pouring out the clear upper liquid without disturbing the sediments is called decantation why did mud particle settle at the bottom of the tumbler mud particle settle at the bottom of the tumbler because they are heavy than water Lakshmi says that sedimentation and decantation are used at home while cleaning rice and pulses for cooking what are the sediments in this process rice and pulses they are the sediments in this process think of other examples where we use this method of separation and list them some more examples of sedimentation and decantation pulp sediments to the bottom of the orange vinegar separate from oil in salad dressing in water treatment plants debris debris means broken or pieces of something they can separate from water in a sedimentation basin thank you my dear children